Right. We're going to make a run to the dump. And it's going to be a gecko camera mounted run. Let's get down here closer where I can tie it off. I don't trust them suction cups that good. I think I got time to clean the inside of the windshield. What I'm going to do is mount the camera to the truck. Mount the camera to the truck and I'm going to narrate my video into my GoPro inside the truck. It would be just the same as if I was speaking to this microphone on this camera here. And I'll just mute the sound on this one. But if it do come off, it sure ain't going to let it wind up in the highway. I'm going to wire it like that. Should just get my go get a bungee cord instead of fooling with all this. Got her tied good and knotted, knotted pretty good. All right. I got nothing better to do. Might as well make a video. What an exciting video this is going to be. We're going to the dump. We went to the grocery store this morning. Spent over $300 worth of junk. That might get us by for two weeks, but I doubt it. So it's usually going a lot faster on that crotch rocket than he is today. Maybe he learned his lesson. Let's check see if I got my driver's license. Yep. For those, for my viewers that don't know, I live in the suburbs of Atlanta. 40 miles south of Atlanta in a little town called Griffin and I'm out in the country six miles from Griffin what we have to do all the time is haul our own garbage to the recycle center most of my viewers already know that Sometimes this red light will keep you waiting and waiting and waiting. M and J hydraulic steering and auto repair. Is there that big a demand for hydraulic steering repair? There ain't much in there for hydraulic steering to except a power steering pump. He could have got away with just putting auto repair on his side. Well, I ain't going to mention the Super Bowl. I'm sure enough people are whining about that. Some of my viewers really celebrated that Super Bowl business so I guess it hurts a lot more when you're kind of a fanatic football fan. I could take it or leave it. I did watch the game. I 
and I will make no commentary about it. It was a good game. They both both teams played quite well. Okay, I need to get in the left lane. Come on, Bobby, here, hot rod. Better come on, dude. Sun glaring off the camera that as we go through here. Might not be too bad. I don't know. I can't tell from in here. But you're riding on my windshield today in a gecko, a Delkin fat gecko camera mount. We're recording with a Sony Handycam. It was a wreck here with an 18 wheeler a couple of days ago. He claimed he jackknifed it. I know what he did. He comes zooming up to this red light. Not prepared to stop. I've seen him actually run this red light, the 18-wheeler. He's just lucky there's nobody coming through the intersection. But I've seen trucks zoom right through on the red light like that light wasn't even there. If they killed somebody, they'd be saying, oh, it was an accident. Most truck drivers are safe. Driver drivers, some of them are fanatics. How do I know? Well, I've done my share of drug truck driving and traveling on the highway. I've ran into my share of them. Hardly a day goes by that somebody don't wreck one of them things out there on the expressway and kill somebody. Fresh eggs. You want some fresh eggs? No, thank you. We just bought a couple dozen down to the Walmart. We actually went to two separate grocery stores today. We don't often do that. Picked out our, what we thought was cheaper at one place and then went to the other. It has turned into a beautiful day in Georgia. It has turned into a beautiful day in Georgia. Oh my. Somebody doing some cabinet work. Oh. Why, you fellas need some help? Oh, I know what he was going to do. He was going to throw wood in the scrap iron bin. They're making him take it to the dumpster. That first bin's for scrap iron. Guess he didn't know. Well, I've done closed the door on my seatbelt. Pay attention, Walter. Here's a Dressler Caterpillar Road Grader. I 
Ain't that a humdinger? Boy, I'd have fun digging and plowing me a road with that thing. Looks like a good one, too. Dresser. I don't know if I've ever heard that company or not. suction cup is holding out there. Are y'all shaking around in here hanging in there steady? Could have told you a story or two today and I haven't. I'm slipping. We use yellow fire trucks in Spalding County. Got that one out there to be washed I guess. They got some burros or donkeys or something out there with them horses. notice I don't exactly stay in my lane but um, ain't nobody around anyway if I see somebody coming I'll make sure I'm in my lane little McDonough Road is awful narrow got a pothole every two feet Approaching Arthur Bolton Parkway. I met Arthur Bolton when I first come to Griffin. He had his own hardware store here in town, one of the big businessmen in town. I guess that's why they named the road after him. thing for sure about today's dump run. I might not have told you a lot of stories, but you got a better look at the countryside around here. At least I hope that camera's running out there.
going to stop for a second right here after I turn in the driveway. I'm not out there to zoom in with my camera. But you might get a look at my gate post right there. My railroad track post. That is mounted in cement. That flat metal bar you see on the side is a was the gate closed and locked. You get a better look at it when we take that post up. But this mountain cement, we're not exactly going to push it over with a pickup truck. We're going to dig it up. That ought to make one heck of a blacksmith anvil. A big old long hunk of railroad iron. Thanks for riding along today. I hope you enjoyed the ride of hanging on my windshield. Thanks for tuning in today, my friends. I gotta go here and turn off my truck. I left it running the whole time we were going to the dump. Somebody asked me to take you off for a ride in that one day. And I guess I can, but first we've got to clean all the junk out of it. Thanks for tuning in, my friend.